chain link end of year price prediction welcome back guys it's crypto rocco from rockstar trading channel in today's video guys i'll be doing my end of year price prediction for chain link and what to look forward to in 2020 so guys chain link let's have a quick review chain link has been one of my best altcoin trades this year and it's not just once it's broken up twice which is really strange in one year it's been great i recommend you make sure you subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button i've been making chain link videos well when it was breaking out, I was making the videos almost every week and I made a chain link uh, technical analysis and fundamental analysis video about 10 months ago start of the year before it broke out so make sure you subscribe to my channel so broke I brought chain link when it was breaking out here guys and it was a really good trade and chain link broke out here I made a live call on YouTube and the free Facebook group uh, you can definitely check it out guys if you're interested and check out this group as well if you want a full trading course and um, and again, I didn't just buy here and sold at the top. I bought and sold uh, most of it as it was going up. And then um, this consolidation zone, the last video I made was what happens with this consolidation zone. This is good to see. But if we break down, it will be bad. If we break out, Chainlink can keep running higher. Uh, when we have emotions involved, uh, we don't know how high the price can go. The price can keep on going higher. But unfortunately, what we didn't want to happen, if you're a Chainlink supporter, Chainlink investor, again, I actually do like Chainlink fundamentally, but I'm a technical analyst trader. And when we see things break down, it is never good. And Chainlink now, you can see it's consolidating and is broken below a key key support level this is a huge level as you can see and um, it's trying to hold this 50% Fibonacci level and daily 200 level so there's still some support left but if Chainlink can't get back above this level guys then that is really bad for Chainlink. We could literally be going down for the rest of the year or consolidating in 2020. Unless we quickly get back above this and maybe I'll take a trade with stop loss here or if bre if it breaks above this red zone, we can have another rally. If you remember, I made those videos about this white line and I made these videos about this red zone. So this is what I'm looking for Chainlink to do. I like Chainlink fundamentally, but I'm more of a trader, so I need to see the good things happen. There's, uh, you can subscribe to other thousands of YouTube channel that will make stupid predictions like oh this is going to 10 million this is going bitcoin's going to a million chain link's going to a thousand again anything can happen in the future but for it to happen for if you're trading look at these levels guys this is what i teach and uh, you can watch my videos before i do a live stream where i share live setups this week i shared two setups uh, that actually worked really well so make sure you just don't go all in with money trading is very risky cryptocurrency is even riskier so you have to learn how to invest and have good risk management so that is my quick thoughts on Chainlink. if Chainlink can't get above this red zone by end of the year next year is not going to look very good for Chainlink. there's going to be tradable opportunities but it needs to get back above this red zone and ideally above this zone for it to run like crazy uh, let's have a quick look at Chainlink usd before i uh, end the video so chain link usd guys it's even it's not looking great guys you can see it looks like bitcoin you know when it was forming this sort of triangle formation and it could be looking to break down if it so the ideal so i'll give you two scenarios for chain link if chain link finds supports here and moves up and it breaks above that red zone that I've drawn before, then Chainlink can have another rally. Chainlink can go to, you know, the $4, $5, and even potentially higher. But if Chainlink cannot, um, if Chainlink breaks below $1.50 against USD dollar, that is a huge, huge level. And if Chainlink breaks, uh, where's my Chainlink BTC? I mainly use BTC chart because I trade cryptocurrency to make more Bitcoin. But if you're trading link dollar, that's what you'd be looking for. So if Chainlink stays above the $1.5 uh, uh, and gets above this red zone that I've drawn against BTC, you know, stays above the 50% Fibonacci level and the daily 200 moving average, then it's still good for Chainlink. But if it can't, then it's not good. What I'll be looking for 2020, I'll make another video is like this. If it does something like this and breaks out, then Chainlink can have another crazy rally like we have seen. And when something stops running like 
chain link with the link army support it can really run we've seen i mean i've followed matic quite closely we've seen it run at hundreds of percent and chain link can do that and but even more if you know what i mean because chain link we've seen had some crazy rallies previously so thank you very much for watching this video guys i hope you guys have enjoyed it if you have enjoyed it guys make sure you smash that like button subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button my question to you to end the video is what is your prediction for chain link do you think chain link will slow down or pull back back for end of the year or do you think it will rally into new highs comment below your long-term predictions as well i do like chain link long term but i'm trading more short term so have a, a comment below both your thoughts so thank you very much smash that like button subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys soon with another great video thank you very much